Over the last three years, we've been working hard to get this optic mount ready together with the M Carbo Brotherhood. That day has finally come, introducing the new Caltech Sub 2000 optic mount. It's been a long time in the making, M Carbo Brotherhood. So we're here just before D Day, getting ready to release the optic mount. Loving it, excited. We want to do kind of a informative slash creative video for once. It's our best shot, really. Um, we are going to do a race. We're gonna do a race on rapid deployment with the M Carbo mount and the Midwest mount. So there's a lot of controversy already, like which is better. The M Carbo mount's not even out yet, so it's hard to really say, but at least give you a little bit of your viewing pleasure here, kind of a race to see which one would be faster to pull out of a bag and get on target. Let's do that. Yeah, so you got a Midwest mount. You know how to use that thing? No, man, what do you got? Do it, figure it out, try to do it. I know, it's not very intuitive. You gotta flip that out, and then you release, lock it. Oh, slow down now. You gotta remove your little safety bungee cord there. Yeah, you always gotta have rope. There you go. Oh, but don't forget, now you gotta get back in the line of sight. Now you're ready to go. You can fight wars now. Now you're ready. But you can also try this one right here, there. See if you can figure this one out. I mean, I'm a Marine, oh. man. I'm not brightest. I know. We gotta watch you Marines. See if you can get that one open. Oh, shit. It's oh, pretty man. intuitive. Okay, so we're gonna do this race. We both got our backpacks on. We're concealing firearms. It's very discreet with these helmets. Nobody can tell that we're, we're here. No. We're ready to play. Good, man. We mean business. But just to help you out, I'm gonna tighten this up like third grade style. I don't need to help. All right, now I'm gonna have to get this loose, then get the bag off, and then we'll go head to head. So he's got the Midwest mount, I got the new M Carbo mount. Let's see which one makes more sense from a concealed position to deploy. You ready? Oh yeah. You wanna do the one, two, three? Uh, yeah, I'll take it. All right. That's it's gonna right. be one, two, three, go. All right. One, right. two, three, go. Yeah. Ah. Oh, which zipper is this? Obviously. Woo! Oh, all yeah. day. All Ooh, day. Fucking... <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't even get the bag off. So practice your bag, you know, get that all down, and then you'll be able to really utilize the rapid deployment feature. But even if you don't know how to use your bag, it's really easy and intuitive to figure out the Encarbo mount. How to use that thing. You want me to show you? Well. All right, so we're going to do that again. You know, Tom said that we need to do a rematch because whatever, you know. I just stopped listening when he started talking about why. And so we're going to do a quick paper, rock, scissors, and then we'll see who gets which one. So winner gets to pick which mount they can run, and then we'll do it again. Okay. I'll shoot. Rock, paper, scissors. Come on, man. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. You can hit Right. I'm going up Carbo. Alright. I'm going Midwest. Alright, well then you gotta tighten up your straps. Alright. I'm gonna go a little loose. I'm there, man. I'm gonna go one shoulder. I'm gonna get a W. Alright, I'm going All right. one shoulder. It's gonna be one, two, three, go. Okay. Alright. One, two, three, go. Dude, these bags are Yep, someone's back. <laughs> Oh, no. oh, you didn't even have it locked. Oh. Got you, buddy. Mother. I'll take a W. I will take a W. Uh, hold on. You ass a fucking ass. Fucking rope, dude. I need to cut this off. You take your time with it, man. <laughs> Woo! Rounds on <laughs> target. Yeah, yeah, buddy. Oh, it's already over? The engagement's over? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. my little piece of rope was hanging me up. Easy like Sunday morning, buddy. You know, because you gotta be tactical with rope, especially yep. if your charging handle's already pushed forward, putting tension on it, like I just experienced. So what we've notoriously hated with this mount is that it's almost like a puzzle that you have to figure out, and under a stressful scenario, it needs me muscle memory, not like a Rubik's cube. So here you are with all this crap contraptions. You gotta have your charging handle back. You gotta have the optic under the bolt tube, and God forbid your charging handle, which easily will drop forward it does that it will smash your optic that's why we threw the crappy optic on there 
but easily could drop forward, damage your optic, because your, your rope's got to be set just right. But there you go. So you got it all whatever. And then you got to say, okay, self, rotate the optic out. Now open the sub. Now get my little piece of fine cordage out of there. And that's what happened to me during the competition. Yeah. <laughs> I'm embarrassed now. I was doing good. And now you got to rotate it. And now remember where your target was because you've had eyes off target for about at least 30 seconds. So dude's already flanked you. You're already probably laying in a puddle of blood, but neither here nor there. And then you got a mount that doesn't even really hold zero anyway because it'll topsy-turvy on you like a nice little seesaw. Beautiful. Exactly what you want when you're trying to get accurate. Anyhow, that's been our big complaint. And I think a lot of guys would agree, but a lot of guys might hate on this. But then when you want to put it away, there you go. Now you got to rack it, lock it, and then don't forget, you got to clear it. And then don't forget your little bungee safety. Now you're safe. God forbid, man, you try to do that in a hurry. Because even now, if you want to separate it, you forget, you're going to be like, oh, this lock's broken. Oh, wait. Yeah. Oh, whoa. Anyhow, I digress. It is what it is, buddy. I got something to say to that. One, two, three, go. Woo, buddy. Oh, damn it, the bag is screwing me again. Watch me, man. Pronto, all day. All right, back to work. All right, everybody get back to work. I feel so stupid. Hey, Adam. Yeah. Starring Tom, <laughs> that's the Marine. Love it. Starring Chris Nelson. Oh yeah. And I'm the videographer, but I'm not showing me. <laughs> Nice and on the head. I'm going to open it up, drop it back down, go back to the hip shot. Alright, get some good daylight in there. We'll go to 15 and we'll keep going. There we go. All right, let's see how we did it. So we opened it up a few times just to show you that it'll hold a consistent zero. It doesn't matter how many times you flip it open, pull it back. It's rock solid the way it mounts just through the handguard. And it's got that hammer sear engagement, which is phenomenally accurate. I don't think there's much to complain with on this. Give me a reason why you shouldn't like that. That's beautiful. I love that. So we opened it. I say it's a pretty decent group. We went from 10, 15, 25, rock solid mount. This thing is beautiful. I love it.